Nilesh, you explain a little bit about precision of equinox, uh, Polaris, and Vega. Uh, so that means about 12,000 years ago, Vega was our North Pole, and yeah. how does that happen? Correct, 12,000 BC, BC, which means almost 14,000 years ago, Vega, Vega was a North Pole. So what is happening is these, the point of North Celestial Pole, see right now what happens is this, North Celestial Pole is just a point. It's a blank point. What is it? That's where the Earth's axis, it's right on the Earth's axis in the north direction. And what happens is Earth has a gyratory motion like this. Think of this like that. That axis, it makes a circle like this, like a like the top, you know, that we throw. It makes a circle like this and that complete circle takes 26,000 years. So what it means is if, if it's pointing like this right now, the star that is closest to that point, it will be considered the North Pole Star. Right now it's a Polaris. So now let's say it moves like this here. Okay, so if you go back say 4,000 years ago approximately, it was pointing towards a star or it was pointing towards the area of the sky and the closest star to that area was Thuban. So that time Thuban was the North Pole Star. And you just continue like this and almost they're exactly opposite because think of it, the whole circle takes 26,000 years, which means half the circle will take 13,000 years. So right now we are here at the uh, Polaris, approximately go 13, 14,000 years, and now the Earth's axis is pointing towards the area of the sky where Vega is there. So it's making that circle, and therefore Vega is the North Pole star in 12,000 BC.